on the drive here in hole number one. We are starting to be at P6 max rest, the bullseye by uh, the rough line with our quarterback. Then we are swapping to a Pock and Thorn bag. Max top spin and one left spin. And here you can play with any P6 plus side spin to plus wind 10 ball. We make the adjustment which is max plus 20p0. In this particular wind angle and wind strength, we are not gonna push up or pull back anything, but there will be some pullbacks and some push up depending on what the apocalypse level you have and also what uh, wind angle and strength you are then having together with that. Max curl to the left, max overpower with a slower needle. We do look to clip the rough with our second bounce and be somewhere between 358 and 367 yards. On the second shot we are going to play with our thorn. We are setting max top spin and one left spin. So very simple in that way. Bullseye by uh, fringe meets the green ball guideline going sorry bullseye aligned with the, uh, the cup. Then I'm turning the screen around and the reason I turn the screen around is because it's so much easier for me to see the ball guideline and the aim point. Uh, if I wouldn't turn the screen around, I would have the rocks and the cliff there in my way, and then I would have to zoom out quite a bit. So I strongly advise to turn the screen around to look at to have the top of the yellow ring by the rough line, then the ball guideline to go left side of the hole. And the left side of the hole is from T to pin perspective. If we're turning the screen around, the ball guideline is going to look to obviously be right side of the hole in that instance, but you will see that on the picture. Adjust is going to be 34% slider, no elevation, P0 numbers, and that we do from the plus yardage, plus 4 and plus 5. Wind angle tweaks here as well. This was an in-between angle. We were in between the red and the yellow. So we are there um, doing three clicks of left curl.